My name is Ty Snaith and I'm an artist. This will be actually the first time that I've been asked to show works from a book in a gallery context. And so for me, that's been really important because I've always sort of seen these parts of my practice, my art practice and my book practice as separate. So I work with a lot of different mediums. Cut paper and watercolour is what I've been working with to make this exhibition, but also all my picture book work. I like the tactility of building things. So you get the drop shadows and it makes it feel real. I very much make work for my sort of 11 year old self. And so when I was 11, I was very interested in conservation and the future of animals and habitat. And of course now speed up like 30 years and we're in a pretty bad situation. The show is an extrapolation from the book that I've been working on, but it's very much its own thing. So it's called Hierarchy of Needs. Animals have a hierarchy of needs too. And it is similar in some ways, but different in other ways. So if we can think of ourselves as the animals, then we can also think that those animals need things like love and belonging, homes. I hope that when people come to the show that they're inspired in some way, either to draw their own thing from nature that they find beautiful or inspiring, or maybe to take action that they hadn't thought was useful or possible. I hope that people come to the exhibition of all different ages, first of all. Like, I'm really keen to attract a multi-generational audience, and that's something that, as time's gone on, I've become very aware of. Kids are amazing, and they're so sort of, like, inspired and, oh, yeah, I can do that. I really want my work to convey beauty, but to inspire kids to, like, you know, bring attention to make change. <laughs>